The Honda Accord was the first Japanese vehicle to be manufactured entirely in the U.S. and was surprisingly a big hit. Nearly 14 million Accords have been sold since its launch. Now, an all-new Accord is on its way and is set to launch next year. The 2023 Accord wears an elegant design that's arguably the prettiest ever applied to Honda's venerable family sedan. The hybrid powertrain has become a more significant part of the Accord lineup for this new generation as it's standard on all but the two least expensive trims. So what should you expect from the new Honda Accord? Let's take a look in today's video. The 2023 Honda Accord model marks the start of the 11th generation Honda Accord, which is all new and prettier than before. Honda offers six trims for the Accord, of which four are hybrid automobiles. The Sport, EXL, Sport L and Touring are intuitive hybrid trims, while the EX and LX are fuel drives. Honda seems to be focused on the hybrid models, which is why this year sees four hybrid trims compared to one out of six last year. Let's now take a look at the engine, transmission, and performance specs. The non-hybrid LX and EX grids of the 11th generation Accord employs a 1.5-liter turbocharged four-cylinder engine that generates 192 horsepower and propels the front wheels via a continuously variable automatic transmission or CVT. The original promise by Honda was a 2-liter, but they've assured us a promising performance with the 1.5-liter turbocharged. The hybrids are there to make up for the ices as well. The 2-liter Atkinson Cycle 4-cylinder engine, which is also said to be brand new, will be paired side-by-side -side with a couple of electric engines to create the fourth-generation 2-motor hybrid energy system. Honda claims the system is going to be highly efficient. The four-banger engine now has direct injection pressure and Honda has said that the new setup enables the use of a bigger propulsion motor with enhanced torque output. This gives it a blended system output of 204 horsepower. The traction motor's mass torque is 247 pound-feet and between 5 and 8,000 rpm, which is up 15 pound-feet than the 2022 Accord. The 2023 Accord lacks all-wheel drive just like previous iterations. However, the hybrid powertrain is given significant prominence. It is the only powertrain available in Sport, EXL, Sport L, and Touring versions. It combines a 2-liter 4-cylinder engine with two electric engines to provide 204 horsepower. Honda also claims to have modified the suspension and steering in the new Accord for better driver performance. We do not have any more details how driver performance is going to improve since the model isn't yet available for test drives. Let's now take a look at the exterior and interior design and technology features. Though spy shots deliver limited information about exterior updates, we can make a few logical assumptions. Honda usually makes their redesigns fairly significant, clearly showing that a new Accord generation has arrived. However, the Accord already has a tastefully upscale, minimalist design in its currently available model year, one that didn't need much updating across the past few releases. There are a few directions the new Accord might take, but it'll probably adopt the new Honda Civic's thinner headlights, more angular front end, and horizontal shoulder line, which seem to be part of the new generation of Honda styling. The outgoing Accord's numerous arcs, curves, and C-shaped taillights will probably be straightened out, removed, or slimmed down to some extent. Like the exterior, the Accord's cabin wears a sleek design with elements borrowed from the latest new Hondas that help to tie them together with familial DNA. The HVAC air vents, for example, hide behind an expanse of honeycomb trim, a clever design element also found in both the new Civic and the CRV SUV. Honda says the Accord's front seats have been redesigned to more firmly support torsos and that the trunk has been carefully shaped to hold up to 16.7 cubic feet of cargo, while LX, EX, and Sport trims come with cloth upholstery, all others come with leather. Speaking of the infotainment display, an upright 7.0 or 12.3-inch touchscreen display provides easy access to the Accord's infotainment system, and all models, regardless of trim, come with a 10.2-inch digital gauge display, standard. Apple CarPlay and Android Auto are included across the lineup, but only those with the larger 12.3-inch touchscreen offer wireless connectivity for those features. The high-end touring trims come with a wireless smartphone charging pad, a 6-inch head-up display, and a 12-speaker Bose stereo system. All Accords come standard with a suite of driver assistance tech that Honda calls Honda Sensing. The bundle of features includes basics such as automated emergency braking with pedestrian detection and lane departure warning, as well as convenience functions such as adaptive cruise control and traffic sign recognition. Finally, speaking of prices, 
we only have estimated prices of the new Honda Accord. The ice trims of the 2023 Accord are estimated to cost between $28,000 and $30,000. The hybrid versions are going to be more expensive than the ice models, albeit it isn't by much. The sport hybrid trim will probably cost $33,000, while the EXL trim could be priced at $36,000. The final two trims, namely the Sport L and Turing Hybrid, could cost between $38,000 and $40,000 respectively. So there you have it, the new Honda Accord 2023. What are your thoughts on the new Accord? Are you excited for the offerings by the latest Accord? Let us know in the comments below. Hope you enjoyed watching this video. Don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel and show us some support. Thanks for watching.